DJI is back at it again, and 2024 is looking to be an incredible year for drone enthusiasts. We're talking about the highly anticipated Mavic 4 series to the possible Air 3S or Air 4, and the compact yet powerful Mini 5 Pro or the beginner-friendly Neo. It's all about pushing those limits of what consumer drones can do. So, let's break down what we know so far, and what these new drones could mean for aerial photography and videography. This is going to be exciting! We've seen images and a video of what's rumored to be the Mavic 4. At first glance, it might look like an older model with those familiar obstacle avoidance sensors, but there's a lot more going on here. If you're familiar with DJI's lineup, you know this points to a successor to the Mavic 3 Pro, rather than something like the more consumer-friendly DJI Air 3S, which we saw leaked earlier this year. The rounded housing style for the main camera gimbal is new, and it looks like DJI's focusing on making the design more streamlined. That could mean longer flight times with the same battery, which is a big win. We've also got Hasselblad branding. No surprise there. But it's what's underneath that's got everyone buzzing. We've heard from another reliable source, Ocetal V, who backed up the gimbal redesign with a video showing the same drone in action. The styling? Pure DJI. This isn't some off-brand knockoff, it's the real deal. A label on the camera module gives us a clue. Production 102-2024-74P0. This isn't just some concept, it's in advanced stages of development. And that new gimbal design? It's rocking a larger triple camera setup, potentially with bigger sensors than the Mavic 3 Pro. Bigger sensors usually mean better low-light performance and sharper images. If that's what DJI's packing into the Mavic 4, we're in for a treat. Now, the drone itself shows some signs of wear. Testing isn't easy on these machines, but that just tells me DJI is serious about refining this model before release. They're known for pushing the limits of what's possible, and with AI getting smarter, we might see more sophisticated obstacle avoidance and tracking features than ever before. Let's put this in context. The Mavic 3 Pro, which dropped in May 2023, brought a lot to the table. A triple camera system, omnidirectional obstacle sensing, and Active Track 5.0. But if these leaks are anything to go by, the Mavic 4 could be taking all that to the next level. While it doesn't reveal much about the specs of these new camera modules, no markings yet, we do know that the gimbal and camera unit appear larger. This could mean DJI is gearing up to deliver even more powerful image capturing capabilities. Timing-wise, we're still in the dark about a potential release date. However, given that the DJI Air 3 was announced in July 2023 and hit shelves shortly after, DJI might follow a similar schedule for its successor. The original Mavic 3 landed in November 2021, with the Mavic 3 Classic a year later and the Mavic 3 Pro arriving in May 2023. If history's any indicator, the Mavic 4 could still be a bit further down the pipeline, possibly trailing the DJI Air 3S on the release schedule. Now let's talk about DJI's next big release, the DJI Air 3S. If you've been following the rumors, you know this drone is shaping up to be something special. This drone has been the talk of the town, especially after a recent leak by Ocidel V on Twitter. The leaked photo reveals a sleek, redesigned dual camera system that's got everyone buzzing. Just like the DJI Air 3, the Air 3S sports a dual camera setup under its nose, but with a more refined design. The edges of the gimbal appear angled, likely for better aerodynamic performance, which could mean efficiency gains and longer flight times. Unfortunately, the resolution of the leaked images is too low to make out specific details like the field of view or aperture, but the upgrades are clear. Speaking of sensors, the DJI Air 3S seems to have forward obstacle avoidance sensors and a sensor array on its underside, much like the current Air 3. But here's where it gets interesting. There's speculation that DJI might be introducing LiDAR sensors to this model. If true, the Air 3S would be the first consumer-level drone to feature LiDAR which could significantly enhance flight performance and obstacle detection. This would be a game-changer for precision flying and safety. A lot of the buzz is around the camera specs. Rumors suggest that the Air 3S will pair a 1 and 1.3-inch sensor with a larger 1-inch sensor. Comparing the sensor housing from the leaked images with the DJI Air 3, the larger size on the Air 3S seems to support this theory. This would be a solid upgrade from the dual 1 and 1.3-inch sensors on the Air 3. 
potentially offering better low-light performance and higher resolution imagery. We also got a sneak peek of the Air 3S in action, thanks to a video from Quadro News. This drone was spotted flying outside DJI's headquarters in Shenzhen, and from the looks of it, we're seeing some significant design changes. The encased propellers, larger gimbal, and that mysterious sensor array on the front suggest DJI is aiming to up their game in both performance and safety. When you compare the Air 3S to its predecessor, the Air 3, the differences start to stand out. We're talking about a potential increase in flight time, enhanced camera specs, and of course that upgraded obstacle avoidance system. If DJI plays their cards right, this drone could set a new standard for mid-range consumer drones, blending the best features of previous Air models into one impressive package. So, whether you're a professional filmmaker, a hobbyist, or just someone who loves capturing epic landscapes, DJI's upcoming releases are worth keeping an eye on. DJI is gearing up to shake things up once again with the highly anticipated DJI Mini 5 Pro, expected to drop around September 2024. The Mini 5 Pro is rumored to come with a significant upgrade, a 1-inch sensor. That's a big leap from the 1 over 1.3-inch sensor on the Mini 4 Pro. If these rumors hold true, we're looking at improved dynamic range and much better low-light performance, which could really elevate the quality of your aerial shots. Plus, with support for 4K video at 60 frames per second, this drone could push the boundaries of what compact drones can do, bringing you stunning video quality that's usually reserved for higher-end models. Now, let's address a pain point from the Mini 4 Pro, storage. The Mini 5 Pro is expected to come with at least 8GB of internal storage. That's a huge upgrade from the previous model's 2GB. This means fewer interruptions for media transfers and more uninterrupted filming. For those who love to capture every moment without worrying about running out of space, this is a welcome change. Battery life is another area where the Mini 5 Pro aims to impress. The goal is to hit around 40 minutes of flight time per charge. That's a substantial improvement over the Mini 4 Pro, which had limited gains in this department. With this extended battery life, you'll have more freedom to explore and capture those breathtaking shots without constantly checking your battery levels. As for the price, the Mini 5 Pro is expected to land in the $750 to $800 range. This places it squarely in the premium compact drone segment, so it'll need to deliver on these high expectations to justify the cost. With the rumored upgrades, it looks like DJI is aiming to set a new benchmark in the compact drone market, combining enhanced camera capabilities, increased storage, and extended flight time. In summary, the DJI Mini 5 Pro is shaping up to be a serious contender in the drone world. With its potential camera upgrades, increased storage, and improved battery life, it's poised to build on the success of its predecessors and redefine what we can expect from a compact drone. The drone community is eagerly awaiting its release, hoping it will turn these exciting rumors into reality. Keep your eyes peeled for its official launch in September. It might just be the upgrade we've all been waiting for. Lastly, we have the DJI NEO, a drone that feels like it was designed for those who want to get into the world of drones without all the intimidation. This little guy is DJI's latest entry into the beginner-friendly market, and it's packing some features that are hard to ignore. The DJI NEO is all about safety and ease of use. Leaked photos from Jasper Ellens show a quadcopter with fully integrated propeller guards, which is a huge nod to safety. Perfect for indoor flying or those just starting out. These full-coverage propeller guards aren't just for show. They're clearly aimed at preventing any mishaps in tighter spaces, making this drone super approachable for newbies or even kids. Now, let's talk portability. The NEO weighs in at just 135 grams. That's 4.76 ounces, making it incredibly lightweight and portable. This is going to be an easy grab-and-go option, whether you're flying in your living room or taking it on a weekend trip. And at a rumored price of $329 for the Fly More Combo, which includes three batteries, this could be a real contender in the beginner drone market. Feature-wise, the DJI NEO doesn't skimp. We're looking at a 16-minute flight time, which, while not groundbreaking, is solid for a drone of this size. But what's really interesting is the rumored compatibility with DJI's Goggles 3. That's right. First-person view, FPV flying, could be on the table with this little guy. Imagine the NEO paired with FPV goggles, giving you an immersive flight experience right out of the box. 
That could be a game changer for beginners wanting to dive into FPV without breaking the bank. Other features include AI subject tracking, quick shots, and even 4K ultra-stabilized video. That's a pretty impressive spec sheet for what seems to be a beginner-focused drone. The design choices, like the multiple control options and even the palm takeoff and landing feature, all point to DJI aiming to make this as user-friendly as possible. And speaking of design, the compact form factor with those enclosed propellers gives off some serious Cinehoop vibes, which means this could be great for tight, indoor flying spaces while still being capable of capturing smooth, high-quality footage. In a nutshell, the DJI NEO is shaping up to be a pretty exciting addition to the DJI lineup. Whether you're just starting out or looking for a lightweight, portable drone with some solid features, this could be the one to watch. Keep an eye out for its official release, rumored to be just around the corner on August 20th. This could be the beginning of a whole new line of accessible DJI drones. And honestly, we're here for it. Let's see how it stacks up when it finally drops. And that's the scoop on DJI's upcoming drones. Which model are you most excited about? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching our video, like, and share with your friends if you find this video helpful. Subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.